Ever wondered how a kidney transplant actually works to save someone's life? This critical surgery begins under general anesthesia, keeping the patient fully asleep and pain-free. A surgeon makes an incision in the lower abdomen, typically on one side, to create room for the new kidney. Contrary to popular belief, the failing kidneys are usually left in place unless they're infected or causing complications. The healthy donor kidney is then prepared and connected to the patient's blood vessels, the renal artery and vein, to restore circulation. Next, the ureter, which carries urine from the kidney to the bladder, is attached to complete the system. Once everything is properly secured, the surgeon ensures blood is flowing to the kidney and that it begins functioning right away. The incision is closed using sutures or staples, and a sterile dressing is applied. Patients typically stay in the hospital for several days to monitor kidney function and adjust anti-rejection medications. A successful kidney transplant can dramatically improve quality quality of life and eliminate the need for ongoing dialysis.